Researchers have just launched a late stage clinical trial on a whole new kind of COVID-19 vaccine, one that's grown in plants. They're looking for volunteers in San Diego. We're going in depth on what you might call the world's first vegan vaccine. Medicago's manufacturing facility looks like a nursery, but inside these plants, they're growing a new kind of vaccine, one that's now being tested in volunteers around the U.S., including in San Diego. They can grow this material very fast. Dr. Dennis Tarakjian is leading the local arm of the trial at the Medical Center for Clinical Research. It's a two-shot administration 21 days apart. He says this vaccine doesn't need to be frozen like the ones from Pfizer and Moderna, so it's easier to transport and store. It's refrigerated at the same temperatures as the shot from Johnson & Johnson, but it uses entirely different technology. The vaccines from Pfizer and Moderna contain little bubbles of genetic instructions that prompt your cells to make a fragment of the virus. Instead of a fragment, Medicago uses plants to grow particles that look like the entire coronavirus. Just check it out under a microscope. The whole point is that it looks like a virus to your immune system so that you develop a really nice, robust response against it. Uh, but it is not a virus, so it, it, in, it, in and of itself, it cannot cause disease. The technology is called a virus-like particle. The FDA approved the first vaccines using the platform in the 1980s for hepatitis B. But the big breakthrough happened in the late 2000s, when regulators licensed two vaccines for human papillomavirus, or HPV, says Dr. Peter Chinhong of UC San Francisco. In the HPV world, it's done wonders, it's gone gangbusters, uh, more than 90% efficacy uh, in HPV. So they're hoping that it will do the same in COVID. Medicago says its COVID vaccine could become the first of its kind grown in plants. Past virus-like particle vaccines were grown in bacteria or yeast. A small phase one study found this COVID vaccine produced 10 times as many antibodies compared to people infected with the real coronavirus. The challenge now will be enrolling enough volunteers for a 30,000 person trial. Anyone 16 and up can now book a vaccination appointment in California. Just because we have something today doesn't necessarily mean we can't find something better tomorrow. Dr. Tarakjian says we need as many vaccine options as possible to fight off variants. It's an opportunity for you to be a part of a cutting edge technology and be the solution to a problem that is devastating this whole world. So for this phase three study, researchers are looking for adults 18 and older who have not gotten a COVID-19 vaccine and who have not gotten COVID itself. Medicago has teamed up with GlaxoSmithKline on this, and they're hoping to complete this trial and submit the results to regulators later this year.